All right. Welcome to the first episode of These Hoes Ain't Got No Mountains. So, today we're going to talk about this uh, $94 million tax refund person. And, uh, you know, she went and called herself trying to file a tax check for $94 million. I guess she want to be like, hello, money talks, this is cash speaking. So, you know, I wrote down a few points that I want to discuss about what's going on in this motherfucking world today. So, first point is, I mean, these are questions slash statements, whatever you want to call them. So the first point is, when you win the lottery, anything over, I think, 500 or $5,000, you gotta go to the lottery commission. So, I don't know what the fuck she was thinking, thinking that she was gonna cash a $94 million check without having to go to a whole nother place to get it. Second, when you go to Walmart to cash your income tax check, I think the highest check they cash is $10,000. I think, I'm not sure. But whatever the case is, $10,000, not 10 million. <laughs> Next point, <clears throat> why the fuck would you pick up a motherfucking check from a Kroger's, a grocery store? The whole Kroger chain is probably not even worth $94 million. Then again, they could be. I don't know. So, they not finna have that much money on hand, though. I mean, come on now. You know, most stores, convenience stores, grocery stores will say, oh, cashier doesn't have code to save. We don't have no more than a couple hundred dollars. Shit like that. Next point. You know your punk ass didn't get $94 million taking out your motherfucking checks when you worked, if you did work. Because your last name is not fucking Winfrey. Slow people ain't gonna get that. Next point. <clears throat> Who the fuck did you try to file the check through? Was it H&R Block? Like, get your cash back, America. I mean, bro, like, what the fuck? Bro, $94 million, it's motherfuckers that play the lotto every fucking day for 1,500 years. You know, I'm exa over-exaggerating, but I mean, no, they play this for all day, all day motherfucking life and still don't win a fucking lottery. And you think you finna cash a $94 million fucking tax check. My last point is, why you acting dumb like, brr, duh. Bro, $94 million. Let me tell you something. 90% of the world don't even get to see one million. And you just think you just right. magically come up on $94 million. In tech, how many people did you claim? All of Africa? What the fuck, bro? Really? Bro, the shit is making me upset. But then too, like, I mean it's funny because like who can be that dumb, bro? Look, let me tell you something. If it was a $9,400 check, they was going to be on your motherfucking ass. $9,400. Because I think you can only claim, what, three people at the most? And everybody that claimed three people or three kids or whatever don't even get no $9,400 back on their taxes. Let me tell you something. I'm a motherfucking truck driver. There's truck drivers out here that don't get $9,400. $9,400? $9,400. Back on their taxes. Then again, it is some, you know, get 10,000, 20,000, you know, it's some that get that. Me, personally, myself, uh, if I get a motherfucking check, a tax return for $94, I'm gonna be happy. Bro, but 94 million? You know what? This concludes the first episode of Mini. By the title of These Hoes Ain't Got No Manners. Hashtag T H A G N M because these hoes ain't got no manners.